Hello guys, welcome back to another cool video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add a WhatsApp chat widget on your website for free. Okay, so I will show you how you can create and customize this widget and how you can actually install it on your website. It's super simple. So this chat widget is coming from this company right here. And we are going to be exploring the company uh, later on in this video. And you can actually create this and use it on your website. And it's going to be for free up to 200 views, which means you can follow this tutorial, learn how to do it and use it on your own project okay so this is the widget okay and when you click as you can see it opens this box and this is all customizable so the text the image the welcome message and all of that which means you can do this this is the create slash customize part and then all you have to do in order to uh, install this is to basically copy paste a bit of code and it's going to work. But I must warn you that in order for this to work and for you to test it on your own, you will have to provide a valid mobile number. So behind scenes, this widget um, has a mobile number, which means if this was a hosted website and if a user came to here and wanted to click in here and after clicking the start button the user would see this information on a desktop not on a mobile because on a mobile you typically have whatsapp chat installed so you don't see this um, the app is installed so you don't see this but this is my point. You need to provide a valid number. And I am not providing a valid number in this tutorial, which means if you do not provide a valid number, the connection will break and you cannot test. But if you do provide a valid number, everything will work, okay? And if this was a valid number, all I would have to do was click the continue to, to chat button and because I do not have WhatsApp installed I could go and select use WhatsApp web okay in this part chances are that you are familiar with so you just have to use your mobile and using the the app you can read this QR code and this works and then you get like the whatsapp both on the mobile and the desktop or laptop okay so as long as you provide a valid number you will make this work so now it's time for us to know how to create slash customize this widget for that we need to go to this company and you can click this button or you can check this video's description and I will provide you with the link. And I must warn you that um, this link contains a, um, a, an affiliate number, which is this, I believe. And in case you use this, I will get a small commission. This means for you, you do not pay more, but for me, uh, I might get a small commission for you in case you use this link for your registration and that is going to help my channel because as you probably know i need to buy a new computer so that might help me okay but i personally already have an account so all i have to do is to click login okay and i get redirected to this page after you uh, sign up and log in you will see something very similar to this. When I mentioned the, the 
200 views for free you can check that actually right here so you can get you can check how many views you have left and when it resets again in case you have reached the limit of usage okay and you can and must explore all of this on your own because i already have this widget in here i need to create a new one that means i need to actually um delete this one so i show you the process from the beginning i'm gonna click delete i'm gonna delete the widget okay and now i will not have a widget anymore on my website it's gone okay because the widget doesn't exist anymore but first thing that we need to do is to create a new widget and i'm going to do that right away as you can see you can select several options several templates to start with but i'm going to go with the generic one which is this one and i'm going to say continue with this template okay and this is crucial this is the box where you need to type the valid mobile number whatever mobile number you type in here is the mobile that is going to get the messages okay so make sure to type a valid mobile number and to be faster not faster but easier to understand what's going on i would suggest you to use your friend's mobile number your mother's mobile number whatever someone else's mobile number right and then after building this and going to local host and using it you will see that that person will get the message that you typed inside your local host project okay but it also works with your own mobile number as long as it's valid so it's up to you okay that out of the way which is crucial let's start customizing this so you have the content you have the settings and you have the appearance the appearance of course it's super simple i'm not gonna even bother to explain it explain you any of this you can do that on your own the settings the important one for me is this open chat triggers explore these options on your own and we will be covering this content part so valid mobile number and now chat bubble chat bubble is actually this icon right here okay and you can change it to whatever icon you want this one or that one whatever that one i'm gonna stick to the original one okay next we have the chat header which is this part right here photo and information okay so i'm gonna click here i'm gonna select another image so my own image okay and you will see it here there you go my name is not John Doe, but of course this is not my name, this is my YouTube channel name. The caption, you can, it's this information right here and you can select whatever or you can go and create a custom message that says something, uh, I, I, will get back to you as soon as possible oops this is the message and you can go back the message is still there back again the welcome message is this portion right here okay i and developers whatever how can I help you today? As you can see, we can also customize this. The last bit is this button right here, okay? Which is the start chat button. And you can start by hiding or showing the icon. And you can customize this text. Start chat now, whatever, okay? So you can customize that to your own preferences and need okay and this is the basics that you need so i now have created slash 
customizing my widget I'm gonna press this button publish right changes will publish it I can now close and I see my widget right here okay and I can click install and I have this code but before that we need a place where to work right so I have prepared this folder in advance which is just a basic HTML CSS and JavaScript boilerplate that doesn't matter I will be providing you with this and I'm actually gonna delete this okay because I was testing of course so now this information I just copy the code I'm gonna paste it right here okay and now I should have in my tutorial not this one this is what I showed you so I can close in my tutorial I can go live using live I want server. to open it right there and there we go we have our icon here and I can actually enlarge this when I press it opens says no messengers are connected connect to a messenger to enable to enable the chat button this means we do not have a mobile number so if you do not have a mobile number if the field is empty you get this message so we need to fix that so we close this we go to edit and we add the mobile number so Of course this is not a real mobile number so you need to add a valid mobile number but just for example purposes I added this one to get rid of that message I'm gonna click publish this should update I believe I just need to refresh the page let's see yeah the error message is gone and I now get the star chat button now this means that this is all you have to do in order to start using this for free up to 200 views okay because now if you were a user let's assume that you are a user if you were on a mobile and if you if you had a whatsapp app installed in your mobile you would have to just press this button and whatsapp would open normally and would open a new window for the number that is associated with this widget because i am not on a mobile i'm gonna press the button and i will see something different of course so i press the button and i get this this is where the message is going to be sent to one more time needs to be a valid mobile number and if I click continue to chat it's detecting that I do not have whatsapp installed in my machine I could download or I could use whatsapp web okay and if I press this it's going to break only because the mobile number is not valid but if the mobile number was valid this will go through and would work I tested this with my own mobile number and someone else's mobile number and it worked like a charm okay so just to show you now you still well you still can go ahead with this step but then if you read this if you scan this QR code uh, it will break for the reason that I mentioned it to you already okay but as you can see this is quite simple this is all you have to do and if you follow these steps i am sure that you will be able to make it work so let me know in the comments section below if you are able to make this work and if you were able to test all of these and what do you think about of this video and if you enjoyed this video do not forget to subscribe to the channel and to share this video with people that might be interested in learning how to create slash implement the whatsapp chat widget 
on a website. Thanks for watching. I will see you on the next video. Bye.